you have to season your food, okay? So for this recipe, we're gonna use this season all, the seasoning salt by Morgan. You can use regular salt, kosher salt, and you don't need much, less than a teaspoon, because you don't want your food to be too salty. And we're gonna add in some black pepper, not a lot, because we're gonna be using some chili powder in this recipe, okay? So I would say about a teaspoon of black pepper. Now that's my liking, season according to your liking. And we are going to cook this, and we are going to allow everything to become brown. Okay, right. y'all. So you have to drain your ground beef. Try to get lean so it will have less liquid oil. This is some of this is water, because, you know. bowl we're going to add in two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar that's one this is the second so that's two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar and in one tablespoon of the w sauce worcestershire sauce so make sure you get one tablespoon okay so that's one tablespoon and if you don't know what i'm talking about this is it the w sauce Worcestershire sauce. Okay, we're gonna add in one tablespoon of brown sugar. We're gonna add in a teaspoon of chili powder. Just a teaspoon, okay? And this is chili powder. So this is a half a cup of ketchup that we're gonna add into this mixture, into this bowl. Whatever ketchup you like, I am using Heinz today. Okay. For these delicious sloppy joes. Your kids will love these sloppy joes. And it's not time consuming because we're doing this in the crock pot. This is a slow cooker recipe. Now we're gonna add in the barbecue sauce. <clears throat> and that is a half a cup of barbecue sauce as well. Okay, get it all in there. And now we are going to mix this together. This is going to be the sauce for our sloppy joe. So mix it together really, really well. Get it well combined. And I forgot adding one tablespoon of mustard. Just one tablespoon of mustard, that's it. Or you can put in some dry mustard, but um, I just use regular mustard. And that's one tablespoon. Now to our crock pot, have it on a high setting, and we're going to cook this for three hours. Now let's put everything into the crock pot. First, let's add our beef mixture. Yeah, my skillet is huge, okay? We're gonna add our ground beef mixture. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna add the sauce mixture into the crock pot as well. We need to mix in. We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna mix the sauce in with the meat first, okay? And I know you may think that's not enough sauce, but it is. Remember, this is all going to cook together, okay? Let me dry y'all in a little closer. My stand wobbling. Okay, so that should be a better look for y'all for these crock pot sloppy joes, slow cooker sloppy joes. I have to repeat it because I want to make sure that everybody knows that this is a slow cooker that I'm using. Or you can just put it on the stove and put a top on it and let it simmer, but you're gonna have to keep an eye on it and it's not gonna take as long as it would in this crock pot. So get that mixed in good. Now for me, I'm still gonna add a little more black pepper to it and salt. 
taste your meat as you go. Because everybody likes a little different seasoning. Just a little bit. Not too much. Okay, don't go crazy. Don't go wild with it. Okay. Now, for this recipe, we call these campfire baked beans. I mean, campfired up sloppy joes. So, if you're out camping or something, it doesn't necessarily have to be camping, but if you, you know, a bit crowd and you need time to slow cook, you got to add in a can of baked beans. Eight ounces of baked beans, okay? Just eight ounces. And go ahead and mix that together. This is a hearty and delicious way to make sloppy joes. And you get it all mixed up really good. I know that baked, the baked beans threw some people off, but you got to try. You have got to try this. Sometimes you got to make a believe out of them. Let them try it. Okay, so after you get it mixed really, really well, you're going to put the top on it. And you're going to let these cook for three hours, three to four hours. Okay. So I'm going to put the top on this. And I'll be back, everyone. In three to four hours. I have it on high. And I'll be back in three to four hours. Okay, so this is our campfire up crock pot slow cooker edition sloppy joes we're gonna stir this up toasted my buns that i am going to put my sloppy joe on i toasted them in my air fryer i just put a little butter on and put it in the air fryer and you want it to be toasted because you know sloppy joe has the sauce on it and it can make your bread soggy and we don't want no soggy sloppy joe bread we want the it's gonna be good. And okay. Here we have it, everyone. Our slow cooker sloppy joe recipe. Top your sloppy joe with some cheese. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Leave lots of comments down below. Stay tuned to my channel for another wonderful video. Peace. Have a beautiful day.